Texas governor and potential 2016 presidential contender Rick Perry is walking back a statement he made comparing homosexuality to alcoholism. I may have the, the genetic coding that I'm inclined to be an alcoholic, but I have the desire not to do that. And I look at the homosexual issue as the same way. Speaking in San Francisco last week, Rick Perry's comparison between homosexuality and the disease drew fire from both the left and the right. John Stewart was quick to chime in. Oh boy. <laughs> Rick Perry's using words again. On CNBC, conservative anchor Joe Kernan said, I have a really high bar for, for what I would take offense to, but that, that, would, that would exceed the bar for me on, on being an offensive comment. And the Los Angeles Times quoted another 2016 rumored hopeful, Chris Christie, as saying, I disagree with him and I don't believe that's an apt analogy and not one that should be made. Perry's comments came after the release of the Texas Republican Party platform, which endorsed, quote, reparative therapy for gay people. To be fair, though, the state's GOP chairman told Texas Public Radio he doesn't agree with reparative therapy being on the party's platform. The therapy aimed at turning gay people straight is strongly opposed by the medical community. There's no uh, published scientific evidence supporting the efficacy of reparative therapy uh, in right. order to change your sexual orientation. Just more than a week later, Perry retreated from his statement at an event in Washington. I've stepped right in it. Perry emphasized the importance of treating gay people with respect and the creation of economic opportunity for all Americans. For Newsy, I'm Christina Hartman.